What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Gold Mouth. Now, I know y'all noticed that I uploaded three videos in the same day. So, um, my reasoning behind that is because, one, I was bored. Two, YouTube is not playing with us anymore okay just since we don't have enough subscribers or enough views which is in my case i don't have enough views youtube is really cracking down and a lot of people are mad at youtube right now because of the you know the, the shady business practices I, I guess you could call them but i see where they're coming from because they just really want us to step up our game they either they either say you in it to win it or just get out that's really what they pretty much want us to do so i've been in the game way way too long i almost quit a couple of thousand times on youtube because in the last couple of since 2000 when i first got married in 2015 um i my video views dropped and the reason why is because I did change. I changed my whole ways, my whole process of bringing y'all certain videos. And, and plus, um, I had a whole bunch of hip-hop abs videos that I had out. And a lot of y'all came because of the hip-hop abs videos. And uh, I got in trouble with the hip-hop abs. They had a strike on my channel trying to ship me down and all kind of stuff, y'all. Like, for real. So, I deleted all of those videos, which I should not have because those videos always get views over and over and over again. And as far as long as they get views, you get money. So, I knocked down a bunch of the big time videos that I had with a bunch of big time views that I have. Uh, uh, my videos with the most views, I deleted them. And I was not aware at the time that I deleted them that, you know, the video still bring in revenue i didn't know nothing about all of that stuff i just knew that they scared me they said it was going uh you know they they shut my video off and all of that kind of stuff they they got my video knocked off so i was scared that they was gonna knock off the rest of them too so when i did that and i changed all together it knocked my money down i'm talking about down when i say down i mean imagine you at your job right I was working back then i was working i was a single parent and i was working two jobs and going to cosmetology school so imagine you you yeah you right there going to work and you was making ten dollars an hour let's just say that you was making ten dollars an hour and then next week you making two dollars an hour I mean, you've been making ten dollars an hour for like two years now, and then all of a sudden, ain't nobody tell you nothing. Your boss ain't saying nothing or none of that, and you you get your paycheck, and you make it two dollars an hour. Okay, that's pretty much what happened to me. Um, I don't think it was the fault of YouTube. I don't know who fault it was, but after I came from full screen because I was signed to a company which was full screen and after I came from them my money got knocked down even more because of all of the YouTube rules and the Google rules and all of that so at at the end of the day I'm gonna keep it 100,000 with y'all we get paid us youtubers get paid for making videos y'all should know that by now if y'all don't watch enough of YouTube we get Google checks or whatnot. So, my check, right now as we speak, you can look at Social Blade all you want to, but my check, I kid you not, I never meet the threshold per month, which is $100. You got to make $100 um, for, before the month is out. You have to make $100 in order for YouTube to send you a check. I have not met that threshold in over two years three years so in other words i'm saying that to say this i literally make like 40 to 50 dollars a month imagine you on your job and you get paid once a month and you bring it home 50 dollars but you can't bring home that 50 dollars because the threshold is a hundred dollars so you won't see that 50 dollars that you made until next month so, in all actuality, you get paid $100 every two months. 
You feel me? What if you went to work every day and you you put this video stuff is hard. I don't I don't appreciate you know getting knocked down like that. But it's partly my fault because I had because of lack of knowledge for one, and also the lack of my um giving y'all all of me in my videos that well I was giving y'all all of me I just stopped doing a lot of things but I'm just here to let you know Gold Mouth is back and she back with a vengeance I'm gonna do things that I used to do and things that I never did before okay because I gotta get my weight up I'm not working no more I used to have two jobs so money wasn't no thing to me back then I was always working and I was doing hair I had two jobs and I actually just say I had three jobs because I had my own salon I, I always had money it wasn't no thing to me, so YouTube, I wasn't looking at it like that. Plus, I did YouTube videos. You could say that was four jobs. I worked in the morning. I clocked in. I worked at night. I clocked in. I went to school. After I left school, I would, when I always had my clients throughout the week, during the week, on the weekends, I had clients. I put up videos. I made money from that, too. I was making money. I always been a natural-born hustler. I always been a go-getter, but... Ever since I got married, I kind of just kind of went downhill. Everything went downhill for me because I kind of lost myself because I moved to Alabama. I don't know nobody. Still don't know nobody. I lost my way in this world. But what I didn't lose is my sense of hustle. I always had that in me, but I just kind of stopped because I got, I got lost in it. I kind of lost my way of what, you know, how to survive because I didn't. Just, no, I'm, I'm going to keep it 100 because I didn't have to really anymore because my husband worked and he became the breadwinner. So, therefore, it kind of knocked me down a little bit. I didn't have to work as hard and struggle so much because he kind of got a little bit of the weight off of my shoulders. But that's not a good thing. That's not a good thing at all. Um, I got to go back to being me. And we're going to make this money. By any means necessary. Okay, and y'all gonna watch me just like y'all watch everybody else make their videos if they get their little money. Okay, because I can't, I shouldn't be at a point where I have to set up a GoFundMe account because I cannot afford my medical bills. I shouldn't be at a point where I got to hustle and do all. Well, the bonnet thing, you know, that's my hustle. That's what I should be on. But I, 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 I it's just, it was, it's just been hard for me. It's just been hard for me. Stress, depression, and all of that coming with these videos. Y'all, I can go on and on about what happened or why I've been lacking. But if YouTube gonna put their foot down, I'm not gonna get mad. I'm gonna come hard. That's all I gotta say. That's all I gotta say. A lot of people mad, but I ain't mad. I appreciate somebody for putting their foot on my neck. Because that's where it need to be. Somebody need to, to put their foot on my neck and say, if you don't come hard, you need to get out. If you can't stay in the heat, get your butt out the kitchen. That's all I need. All I need is a reason. And I'm finna give it to you. That's all I come to say in this video, y'all. And I will holler at y'all later. Bye.